What's up guys, in this short tutorial, I will show you how to fix network lag, a high latency and packet loss when playing Team Fortress 2 on your PC. This should be quite an easy tutorial, but if you still have any questions, then leave a comment and let me know. In case you experience a high server-sided latency, then the issue might not be on your end, but rather related to the server you are playing on. Make sure that the servers are working fine by visiting this page, everything you need will be listed in the description below. Here, you can preview recent reports about server issues, and below, you can use the live outage map to see where the issue is coming from. The second link will show you more information about player accounts and the server they are playing on. In case the servers are working fine, then you should make sure that you're using a reliable network connection. To test your connection, visit speedtest.net. A normal app and download speed without interruption is important to have a stable gaming experience. Especially your ping should remain below 100 milliseconds. Make sure to use an Ethernet cable to ensure the best possible connection. If you have to use a Wi Fi connection, then make sure to restart your router or modem if you haven't done this in a while and reduce the amount of devices connected to the same network. Next, Open up your command prompt by searching for CMD and hitting enter. Ping google.com. This command will check your latency and packet loss to Google servers. Use the command ipconfig slash flush DNS. This will flush and reset the content of your DNS resolver cache. Using this command will in any case improve your latency issues. You can now exit out of your command prompt and open up your task manager. Here, navigate to your resource monitor, as you can see in the video. In the Network tab, open the processes with network activity. And after a few seconds, you will see every process using your network connection. This might be your browser running in the background, Steam or a download bottlenecking your connection. I suggest you to only end the processes which you know won't break your operating system. Below. You can also preview your network utilization in percent. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.